Wyoming's Veterans Welcome Home Day honors combat veterans who were shunned when they came home. During the time which I was uh, a member of the, the military, we were advised not to wear our uniforms when we went off base. Uh, we were not to basically talk about the military. The March 30th celebration is an annual event by law in Wyoming. Governor Matt Mead signed the bill last year. This year, all well, the focus is on Korean War veterans, but all veterans were invited to participate. I, it means a lot to me as well. I mean, most of my deployments I came home from uh, came back on a Gray Navy ship. They tied up to a pier and we unloaded the landing force and that was that. But uh, I think it's great that local communities are getting together like this and uh, welcoming home their vets and thanking them for their service. It's a good tribute. Events take place around Wyoming. In Wheatland, Lee Alley, a Vietnam veteran and one of Wyoming's most decorated servicemen, took his turn to speak during the celebration in his hometown. I ask veterans that I talk to on a daily basis, take the silent bow that I have taken, and join me as I walk the malls and the airports of this great nation in search of the young men and women who are going off or returning from war. I always stop them and I grab them and I shake their hand and I look them in the eye and I say, I'm so proud of you. But as I look in their eye, I also know that I understand that they are going to pay a price for the freedoms that we enjoy. Never again, never again must we reject the warrior. From Cheyenne, Wyoming, I'm Army First Lieutenant Christian Van Eisen.